Hello there, you're watching the BBC. Shortly coming up, we'll be having Jimmel fix it. But first, an episode of Aiden's Living Room. <laughs> oh, hey kids, I didn't see you there. I was just watching some porn. Let's put that to one side for now, though. Ah, anyway, on with the show. In today's episode, we'll be having special guests Fidel Castro and Ronald Reagan coming in, and they're going to be playing conkers to finally decide whose system of government is superior. You don't want to be missing that. We've all also got our yearly poetry competition. We pick a topic at random. The prize you can win is a holiday to Guantanamo Bay. Ooh. And now I'm going to be picking the topic at random from the bowl to see what you're going to be writing about this year in our poetry competition. Oh, got the piece here. Let's find out. Human trafficking. Ha <laughs> ha Can't wait to read those poems. Hey dude, what? I thought you said this was a d- Tasty cup of tea. Mmm, delicious tea. Hi, welcome to another Talks with Norm segment of the show. How are you doing today, Norm? <laughs> Another witty one-liner from the gnome, as always. He never fails to crack me up. Anyway, gnome, what's been going on with you lately? You got any funny stories to tell us? Oh, why don't you tell us that one then, gnome? Oh, <laughs> oh, that's a good one. So, gnome, where did all the Armenians go? Ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho, an excellent response from the gnome. Anyway, no. anything you'd like to tell us about before this segment ends? Anything important you need to get off your mind? How, what the fuck did you just say? You shut your mouth about that, though. You tell no one that. How dare you? How dare you say such awful fucking things in front of all the children at home? You're fucking disgusting, no. You're fucking done. This is your career. ended. You piece of... Post at the door? Ho ho ho! Some new exciting posts to read. 
Whoa! It's time for another exciting mail section. Ho ho ho! Ooh, this letter is from a little boy named Peter, age 73. Hi Aidan, love your show. Always watch it with my kids. Ha 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 ha! Good job, Peter. Really love your viewing. Keep it up. His favourite three things are going to the pub and going to the pub and doing cocaine in the pub. Peter's question for me is, Hey Aidan, I'm always in the pub and there are lots of very nice young lasses in the pub if you are interested in coming over. And he put a little ha 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 ha. Would you like to join me in the pub sometime, Aidan? Whoa, good question, Peter. However, I recently spent all of my money on a three-day cocaine vendor and unfortunately cannot afford to come to any pub. I also tend to not drink. I really only stick to recreational heroin. Anyway, that's the end of today's post section. See you all next week. And now time for the science segment. Our whole universe was in a hot, dense state that nearly 14 billion years ago expansion started. Wait, the Earth began to cool, the Atros began to drool, the Anaphals developed as we built a wall, we built the pyramids! Five science history unraveling the mystery that all started with the Big Bang, hey! Hey kids, it's time for the science segment, but first we need our safety goggles to make sure we're doing science safe. Ah, nice and safe for doing science. Whoa. Anyway, in today's science segment, I'm going to be showing you how to teleport. First, you stand where you want to teleport from. Alright, and then we just go to me from there, so you don't see me moving, but I just like teleport in the editing. Right. And then you just teleport where you want to go. Next up, we'll be showing you how to time travel. Whoa! That's exciting! <sighs> Whoa! I just time travelled 15 seconds into the future! Ha ha ha! Oh, I'm all out of science juice for one week! We'll see you all next week! Ha ha ha! Our whole universe was in a hot, dense state that nearly 14 billion years ago expansion started. Wait, the earth began to cool, the atros began to drool, the Anaphals developed as we built a wall, we built the pyramids! Five science history unraveling the mystery that all started with the Big Bang, hey! exciting cooking segment on Aiden's living room. Ha ha ha! Today we're going to be cooking ratatouille, but unfortunately you won't be using real rats for this one. First you want to preheat your oven to anywhere between 70 and 240 degrees. What you need is a big pan for this one. You want to test your pan and make sure it's extra pan strength. That sounds pretty patty to me. First up, you want to add some veggies to the pan. You want to add a little bit of seasoning to them too. Next up, we can't forget the most important ingredient. Lemon juice. Everyone knows, with ratatouille, you got to have the finest lemon juice. Next up, you want to make sure your ratatouille is nice and crunchy, which is why I'll be adding some Doritos. Once you've got a nice sizzle going, it's time to add some rice to it to puff it up. Haha, <laughs> just a couple splashes of rice on there. Oh, a brilliant flip there! Oh no, it seems I've made a bit of a mess. Well, it's a good thing I've got some kitchen cleaner to clean this up. Ah, now it's spotless. Oh my god! I can't fucking do it! Ah! Mmm, ah! ah! that's 
looking delicious. Join us next time for another delicious cooking segment. Ha 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 ha. I'm gonna eat chow on the cadre. Have some shawl aram dum de I'm so tired out. Last week, we asked viewers if they wanted us to tell them a story before bed. Our viewers said no. What's that? What do you mean you've got my wife? I only just got her back. Well, this calls for a... my face and stars to fill my dream I'm a traveler of both time and space to be where I have been Take with elders of the gentle race this world has seldom seen They talk of days which they sit away all of the Do you think that's enough? <laughs>